This is my module four project. So let's review and go over the different formulas. The volume of a cylinder is pi r squared h. We get this pi r squared from the area of a circle. h is the height. The volume of a sphere is 4 thirds times pi r cubed. And we derive this from the different formulas for circumference and area of circles. The volume of a pyramid is also the same as the volume of a cone, which is one third times pi r squared h. We have this one third here because the pyramid is one third of a cube and a cone is one third of a sphere. And so, I'm going to move on to rotating 2D to 3D objects. So, we have certain 2D shapes that when rotated around their vertical axis, like, yeah, their vertical axis, they can shape 3D shapes. So, a right triangle shapes a cone as shown here. A rectangle shapes a cylinder as shown right here. And then there can be multiple shapes that shape a sphere, but just for common sense, a semicircle to a sphere. And so, this is a really pretty simple concept to understand. And then, there's just some examples in real life. So, here is an apple, and it looks mostly like a sphere. This toothpick container, it obviously is a cylinder, and this banana it probably closely, most closely represents a cylinder. And so that is all for today.